we want to solve the equation x minus 4.88 equals negative 1.6. We can also read this as x minus 4 and 88 hundredths equals negative 1 and 6 tenths. The solution to the equation is the value of x that makes this difference on the left equal to negative 1.6. To solve the equation, we need to isolate x on one side of the equation, and because x is on the left, our solution will be in the form x equals some value, again, that makes this difference equal to negative 1.6. So looking at the left side of the equation, we don't want this minus 4.88 here with x, and therefore, we need to undo this subtraction by performing the inverse or opposite operation. Well, the opposite operation of subtraction is addition, and therefore to undo minus 4.88, we will add 4.88 to both sides of the equation. So adding 4.88 on the left side will undo the minus 4.88, and whatever operation we perform to the left, we must also perform to the right to maintain equality. And notice how here I show the addition vertically or underneath the equation. Some textbooks would show the addition horizontally and that would look like this. We would have x minus 4.88 plus 4.88 equals negative 1.6 plus 4.88. Showing the addition horizontally is equivalent to showing the addition vertically as we have here. Going back up to our equation, Looking at the left side, adding 4.88 undoes the minus 4.88, or we can think of this as negative 4.88 plus 4.88, which is simplified as zero. So now on the left side, we just have x equals. On the right side, this sum will give us our solution. And because we're adding numbers with different signs, we'll have to subtract their absolute values and then use the sign of the number with the larger absolute value. Let's show some work here on the side. We have negative 1.6 plus 4.88. So we'll first find the absolute value of the two numbers. Well, the absolute value of 4.88 is 4.88. And the absolute value of negative 1.6 is positive 1.6. And now we'll subtract. And we always subtract the smaller absolute value from the larger absolute value. So we'll have 4.88 minus 1.6. We want we can put a zero in the hundredths place value here. Let's put the decimal point in the difference, and now we'll subtract. Eight minus zero is eight, eight minus six is two, and four minus one is three. So the difference is 3.28, but remember, we need to use the sign of the number that has the larger absolute value. 4.88 is positive, and it had the larger absolute value, and therefore the sum is positive 3.28 which means our solution is x equals 3.28. Before we go though, let's check our solution by substituting 3.28 for x in the original equation to make sure it satisfies the equation. Performing the substitution, we would have 3.28 minus 4.88 equals negative 1.6. Let's check this difference on the calculator. 3.28 minus 4.88 does equal negative 1.6. So we have negative 1.6 equals negative 1.6, which is true, and therefore our solution is correct. I hope you found this helpful.